if we're so much more productive, yeah, what does software look like? Are we just going to take Fridays off? Or like, are, are we, are we going to get paid less? Are just regular people going to be able to build this stuff for us? Okay, that's a that's a that's an interesting question. My viewpoint on this, for these simple kind of apps, I kind of yeah. feel like there's not going to be a tremendous amount of like economic value that's going to be there. There will be a lot of personal value, but in terms of economic value, because this technology has become democratized, you are mm. not going to be able to sell that podcast downloader to a bunch of people for yeah. like thousands of dollars is effectively yeah. what happened. That market has just disappeared in, in some ways, but hey, like now you can do it for your own personal stuff way more efficiently and you don't need to go on, on Fiverr or whatever to go and yeah. to go out and build it. But I think here's my take on it for the companies. I don't look at it as, hey, like these companies are nice entities that are just going to pay their developers the same amount and ask them to work less. No, actually, like if you were to look at it from like a purely capitalist standpoint, they have a better return on investment now on investing in software. Yeah. Their given dollar now is giving them more technology. Then the question becomes for this business, what is the ceiling of the amount of technology they can create and get value from? And I think for most companies that are large, there's a lot of technology that can be built to actually go in and optimize the business.